of minutes, and then he can certainly snowball out of control. Uh, plus, plus six health regen aura actually, so that kind of eliminates the need for some uh, yeah, for some regen here, and also the nuke. He has six times 140 damage, or well, 60 even. That's a little bit short now, no one gets hit by that, but as I said, he has 70 charges right now, he's not gonna go down anytime soon, but perhaps with Snaker coming in, might be able to burst him down, they do have a brain type here, pops it out, there's the first blood! Can't even get the snake charges off, not quite expect that kind of commitment here, but now Solo might be next on the list, there's a nightmare coming out, a couple of right clicks with the flame break, and it's two heroes down just like that, uh, uh, Chen will be the trade as Mac comes in, trying to pick up a slack, but now he might be in trouble, there's still a creep running around, does not have enough Dyer's mana for another nuke though, unfortunately, otherwise Mac might have been dead already, but Jen will also made his way in here somehow, looking for the kill, no mana for Fissure though, so it looks like the Nature's Prophet will be able to make it out, with Solo no one both coming back from that already. Being kinda of negated by the Oracle, but yeah, some, there's some good aggressive rotations there from a lot of uh Navi oh, heroes lane. though. Oh, they're gonna go again perhaps onto Dendi here with the cold snap. Sounds strike, he almost flies into it. Doesn't end up doing so, but the nuke from Solo and an extra couple of right clicks. Yeah, no one's doing pretty well in this lane. He has a death, but now two kills to his name. He's oh feeling God. pretty Don't confident here. Mac, he gets hit by the Stormhammer. Snake off. He does have the Nightmare, pops it up now. A little bit of extra damage, and should be able to finish it off with a Brain Sap. No, not quite. Did your art, not, did not quite get the right clicks in, but... Well, Seneko, able to pick up the slack with one right click of his own to finish. Take a little bit more farm. Yeah, he's tanky, yeah, he's big, but he doesn't really have a whole ton of damage until he gets a couple items here. We're gonna have Seneko initiating here onto Mag. I think this is just casual harass, but we've got Sven going in, has the Stormhammer ready, is gonna cast it, Mag is gonna be going down here. A couple more last hits will do it, and Seneko's on a killing spree. Fantastic rotation, and by that thing, setting up the kills. Seneko needs to be very anything. careful oh, here. Yeah. We're gonna see the That's fortune and cast now. Ember Spear going in. Pasha's going in. He's got the searing chase. It's gonna be a thumb strike as well. Seneko getting very, very low. One more last will do it. He does end up going down. Ember Spear gets the kill for that. Uh, courtesy of his flame guard. And now it's technically a standard trade. Normally we're talking about tier twos. Uh, when that happens. And now, well, Navi. Have a little bit of extra safety now behind them, behind the Sven, he can be more aggressive now, Baja is going in anyway here, teleports galore from Vega, wanna make something happen here, Sneko left alone from Navi, as the rest of the team wants to get the hell out, they catch Dendi, doesn't have actually, <laughs> didn't have the Firefly to get out, off the Sprout, so Vega, going, going in head first, and they catch two targets. With the cores out like they need to, securing farm. I mean, they've obviously been looking for ganks and trying to find something, but it seems like they're just not getting it. Ganks, top lane, but... Fortune Zen will not quite hit thanks to the blink that he's picked himself up as well, but there's plenty of heroes here. Death of Sprout keeping it in there from the He is screwed with the Dwelling Blade now. Potential turn around of He takes a lot of damage here, but the Aegis will be triggered first. There's some Fiend Scoop as well as a Nightmare coming in. Dandy with a follow up lockdown on Mac, but there's some. Uh, uh, Solo coming in with a false promise, stopping that from happening. No one's still quite ha uh, quite healthy. Solo, not so lucky, but now Denny and the cat bounce back on top of the airport here. Digira stops it from happening on Seema. Will get chopped down, maybe not here with the Magnus as well, so the heal's coming out. Vega still mostly alive. Pasha though, uh, well he will get stopped by General running right into the fissure. No one's still alive, but he's dropping low, out of mana, out of cooldowns, out of health points, and Dichera, well, that age is definitely helping out in this particular instance. He's being kited, more or less, by Seema, and uh, can't quite catch up, but the rest of his team helping out with the blinks. And this is locked down to follow up Mac, kind of caught on the bad spot. He should end up falling here, but perhaps a turnaround, no one. They do, does get the cold snap off on the Earthshaker, so that'll be at least something else they got after all of what's said and done. It's kind of a long team fight here, but at the end of the day, it looks like Navi. Yeah, at the very least, will keep them away from the tower. Duran caught by Mag, who still has the Quelling Blade, so it's proud. Not really locking him down, Pasha. Well, he sees him. There's a stun of creeps, actually, but now a little bit of actual lockdown. Shoot the trick, and now the actual stuff committed. And that's the Embersburg going down just like that. You have to be so, so careful if you're Pasha. You can't afford. Just a clean back off and no towers for Navi just yet. Yeah, yeah, at least Nature's Prophet in the jungle. General going in, catches him out with a fissure. I don't know if they can follow up, but Dendi's here. He's got the force, he's got the blink, he's gonna go with the lasso, drags him forward into the fire. General waiting, doesn't want to kill him just yet, wants to secure Dendi a little bit more farm. We're gonna see some more sticky napalms oh. going out now. Vega, 
Ah, uh, looks like they're gonna lose their nature's profit. This could turn bad though, as General gonna be taking the full force of a death word to the face. General oh, trying to keep it up with a twice, but he gets oh. caught out by the deafening blast from the invoker. No one securing himself a kill. And that's gonna be the end of the initiation. They lose the Earthshaker, but they take out the nature's profit. They might know what's going on, but can they rotate quick enough to stop it? It's already at half health. Oh, I see no one going in tornado. Time, yeah. Tornado MP comes out, it's on the digital run, art style here, dandy. Cannon's trying to screen a little bit. A bunch of trees coming in, but the Roshan already down. Can they make the clean escape though? Tasha is there, the slight of fist, but... Only find Dots on exactly kind of target in one go. Now sticks around for too long. Dandy catches him with the lasso. With the ass falls from his keeping the save. Dots now will end up being bursted down. Yet the Aegis though, it's for some reason, I don't know, he's gonna be back. They, they didn't quite expect that, but Pasha, well, he's not getting caught out. He did have the safety remnant. Same time though, these other two heroes, Echo Slam on two. And that will bring them down just like that. Nice catch there from General. With a follow up for the rest of his team, and, and now we don't lose anything attack. really. <laughs> I don't exactly know what kind of buyback status there is. Mac would have come back with an ultimate, doing that little bit of extra bit of burst damage that Navi couldn't have handled, so. Not playing it safe now, no one no isolated one. Blink lasso, but there's a false promise. So, uh, <laughs> he was ready for that, for sure. Absolutely, Vega definitely playing some mind games. Oh, here in the top, Dendi, catches the him. He catches him, four step out. And yeah, there it is. Perhaps turn around though. Digi Rai wants a fight, gets a blink sound until no one. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, it's all it takes. And he do get the invoker after all. He's hit his peak at the moment. Uh, he can now go in with his team. He's incredibly strong. He hits hard. Well, there has to be follow-up though. They gotta catch Vega out of position. And it looks like that might be the case here as Solo. He's gonna be going down. He does now have the Oracle ult on himself, but it's not enough to keep him alive for long. Earthshaker grabs the kill for that one. And Navi. Is he looking for more? He's gonna go Firefly on some creeps, but... Pretty damn fast. No, Dendi is ready to jump. <laughs> <laughs> he's waiting up here. He's on the high ground. He's gonna ah, jump. not quite get it. It's not quite Tornado get it. Falls about not quite across. And now EMP stops him, breaks him down. Helps him BKB even. It's not enough to bring him safe. That's actually the gem on the deck too. <laughs> and that was very Absolutely. Well. He d does have the grits, but it doesn't have oh, the... Oh, God, we're there. gonna see One, the battle two, here! Ah. pops him down! Three hits there for that Sven, taking down a full health Ember Spirit. Significant if you think about that big control factor of the Tornado EMP. Well, we've got a smoke here from the Dire. They're rotating and they want to find something. Looks like they might find General. They're gonna go in. He disjoints the, uh... Stun there, oh. trying to TP out. He does Radiance not get away. Now General is gonna be falling here. He does end up going down to the Invoker. There, Vega. Oh, with the invis with the DFP, just to be able to be a little, uh, just try to be a little bit annoying, but won't be able to do as much without the Roshan going down. Cheese as well as the Omelette dropped on the ground. So, well, Ditcho with the Aegis. Oh God, I'm gonna go in. He may try to trigger uh, immediately, but now BKB comes out. No one's caught. That's the false promise, keeping him safe for the time being. Meanwhile, back Pasha, looking to. Stop. <laughs> Looking to clean up, and Snake in general, they're almost solo here now, and they are in fact doing exactly that. Solo at the same time now, caught, no more defensive capabilities, and that's two for nothing so far. Not even the Aegis trigger, they do catch Mag with the Might Bear at the edge. And, oh, man, yeah, that's still play there with the tree and taking it off, but he should still end up falling here. Then the Snake on art style, they even commit the last to make absolutely sure that this Nature's Prophet ends up falling. And, and yeah, what's the trade-off? No one. He, he just said, fuck it, I'm not joining that fight anymore. <laughs> I'm just kidding out. Earlier about, you know, how do you lock down a Sven for long enough to take him out of a team fight? And, well, that's how. We are going to see Seneko here. He's uh, invis up. Oh, he does no fire one. no one. Now, they Dendi see here. It. The blaster comes out. Seneko's there as well. With the free script to follow General, too. And that is not something that you can't afford. I mean, it does have buyback, but... As I said before, you have to be super, super careful going for these kind of plays without knowing where now we are. And now, Dejirad at the same time just solo killed solo, fittingly enough. Now I might even catch Seema there. <laughs> the act will be triggered by Pasha. Oh, uh, will be interrupted by Pasha, I should say. Before Sven can really be getting too much mana. So it looks like now we will call it quits for now. Might actually catch General here. Oh, do they? It might actually be a bait the other way around. Pasha caught with the Fisher. Then he's there with the lasso. Drags it up across. Ditcher actually. <laughs> it goes in deep. It's caught with the hacks. There's no follow up though. It is now perhaps from 
Yeah, from everything. Digital was just trying to find someone who's gone inside this crowd. There's so much damage, he just doesn't seem to care. It's the entire death board. He's being sent back, but he didn't even think they needed that. Two people were down for one and decided. Actually, it might have been a big misplay there from Chen sending the Sven back to base. Now, try to TP to a lane, but that creep got wrecked. Now, Sameko also falls into triple kill for no one on the back of what should have been a dominating fight for Na'Vi. Yeah, that was a uh, fun little Sunstrike kill to watch there. We've got two gems on the deck. They're dyers if they want to grab them, but now we're just going to see some more push here as they got, they want to grab some map advantage. They're going to go for the tier two, which yeah. don't worry. It's okay. Nothing really happened. <laughs> <laughs> Top lane though, we've got a pig here onto Dendi. Looks like no one going to be trying to go in. There's an ice wall oh, called down. He is going to be very, very low. He's trying to force oh. out himself to safety. One more hit will do it. Can you Sunstrike? get out of here? Sunstrike yeah. will go through. Sunrun perhaps though, with the fiend script here, plenty of wraparounds on the side of Na'Vi, they do catch no one on the back. Remember, that's a guy who bought back early, he's down for, for the count for 100 seconds. So now, that might actually be the yeah the chance for Na'Vi to come. We might actually see the last seed fight coming into play without it invoking for another 40 seconds here. They want to try and slow down Tetra as much as they can, which is shoving away at this tier 3 tower. Dendi always with a threat of a blink last, and there it is. They do get it on solo. They have an ultimate available anyway, even if you want it, but that's another hero down, that's the axe on the Seema, if he goes down too, that could almost spell doom for Vega, but the flame wreck pushes him back instead, just keep them away, just take the racks, go straight for the middle lane here, they just soften up earlier too, and two sets of racks going down to shore, before no one can come back. This is the last stand for Vega, they know it's the last stand, we're gonna have the death ward pop down, but it barely tickles Fen. he's now gonna be uh, glimmer caped up, getting out safely, okay. Mag does find him out though but there's the blink out of the little sprouts and i don't know if vega can chase fast enough to catch him we got general here in up has the fissure has the echo slam if he needs to use it radiant oh, they, could, they could turn us through this royal channel they should be able to get it without Navi being able to interfere that being said they're not taking it particularly fast so now he's making the way in now we do have general that might be his dunk if he wants to go for it no please be be universe be universe <laughs> Not oh yet. man! Not tornado today. though. Right. That is a long tornado. It goes through. Doesn't catch out anyone. But now no one's here. He's gonna get sheep sticked up by art style. Not Dendi's here. He's gonna go and use the BKB. There's gonna be a stun up from the spender. Trying to get him down. They've got the Oracle. Alone, trying to keep no one alive for as long as possible. Echo slam comes through. Crazy damage. Deafening blast. We've got two gems on the deck. And now Dikira running around looking for something, but we're not done with the action here as Mag, he's in the fight, no one coming back in as well, our style of a pig, and no one gets burned down, triple kill for Dikira, now Mag gonna be nightmared up, I think they're gonna get him as well, I think this might be it, I don't know if Ember Spirit's big enough to control this. Shame. Two gems on deck once again, and only Pasha, the one man left standing and worried about it. Also, with the walk ride, it's not something that we've talked about, but it's something that's very, very useful up against the slide of this as well. Um, it's just negating so much of that damage, and without any big damage items to counteract that, it's just this is it. no last joy for him. And yeah, no one caught once again with the lasso. He's gonna fall apart and try to do what he can. Max up again with the death one. That will be interrupted. Snake will be the only man to fall. Did you ride actually though? Carl with the sprout, Carl with the chief, so he might actually fall here. And yeah, he realizes that. <laughs> That's a f almost th 1400 gold going the way of Solo. Not sure if they can make too much. Locking on the first time, they can get him the second time, but Pasha, he's smoked up. He wants to get something. He needs to keep the farm train rolling. But Navi are doing such a good job making Vega scared, keeping them on their toes, preparing for the next initiation. The nature of the rapier means that buyback doesn't even matter all that. Look at Suneko though. <laughs> Sunstrike barely missing. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't quite expect him to take that much damage, but there were a lot of creeps there next to him, plus the crits, and now, Link last on to Solo, they have the false promise on himself, and now, oh, nice tornado catches him, Ninja Rod just at the edge, keep the soul alive, what that before gets one shot, that is, that one from the higher ground, but that will be interrupted by the sheep stick, and this might be the very last fight here, no one trying to get himself out of there, same for Macri, he pops his old man, pops another one, perhaps after the refresher, just try and keep the way, trying to do a little bit of damage to that. Pasha, still alive, but now remnant him back to base and Well, they lost the Oracle, but they didn't do a lot of damage to Navi. 
they're still very much alive and in fighting shape, save for some ultimates that are not going to come back on cooldown for quite a while, but they do have that Constrict to spend. It looks like they want to end this here. They want to go for the towers, no one's stopping that from happening though. Digira is out of mana, out of DKB time, now has to be forced them back. The rest of the Navi, you have to take up slack now, no one sheeped up. Now, Dendi comes in to try for less, so if you just had it, another couple of seconds of cooldown going to it. Now Pasha comes in, tries to help, but Mac will be the sacrificial lamp. GG! Yeah, this is just too much. Too There's many mega so much GG will fire take in the face right now. Oh, uh, but God. it is going to go the way of Na'Vi. They take the Spesto on Sirius. We've got another coming up, though. Yeah, that is kind of... <laughs> <laughs> kind of the best news I can give you right now after 60 minutes Larkfest here. Now the repeating their performance with Dota Pit. They